going to get every part. Glad I'm not a drama club freak who gets his knickers in a knot over this junk. Nobody else. Go for chimney sweep, dude. If there's a character who pops wheelies as she sings, I'm it. Not a fan of musicals myself. I mean, when in real life do people ever break into song? I'm the headmaster of Strange Hill High. I sing a song as I walk on by. It's totally random, so don't ask why. Well, I've been busy making costumes and props. What? So you're doing stage crew for the musical? <gasps> There's a musical? I'm going to audition for one of the leads. Bex, you've got so many talents. Too many to even list one right now. But are you sure singing is one of them? I was up all night practicing. I sounded great in the shower. Listen! I'm singing in the shower With my mighty big young power Been doing it for an hour Cause I bet Stunning. Uh, you know, there's a lot of ways to be involved in show business without singing. Frankenstein never sang, and he's quite famous. Well, I want to sing. I feel it inside me, and I have to let it out. Same with the sausage I ate this morning. But... You really want to audition, don't you? You know what? Go for it. Break a leg. That's an awful thing to say. It means good luck. Oh, then Becky, I sincerely hope you were hit by a bus. To music class, and then the audition! Are we good friends or terrible friends? We're friends. <sighs> Once we finish class, we'll go to the gym and begin auditions for the musical. Oh, yes. Miss Crackle, just so I can sing it to myself over and over during class, is there a particular song you think I should audition with? Miss Butters, how can I put this? Oh, yes. Give up. What? But if you throw a can of nails into a tumble dryer with a bunch of rocks, that would be more pleasing than your singing. <laughs> oh, she's good. This stuff is gold. <laughs> Teachers are supposed to be encouraging, but you're always doubting me. I doubt that's true. I'll prove you're wrong. I'm going to audition and I'm going to get the lead. Oh, Miss Butters, you couldn't sing to save your life. Maybe she was just wishing you good luck. Now, today we're going to talk about lullabies. One of the most soothing names in music is Brahms. Who can tell me what a lullaby is? An old-fashioned ditty that puts you to sleep. Like the teachers in this school. <laughs> oh, Mr Montgomery, you're such a rascal. I learned from the best. <laughs> Those two make quite a team. Yeah, like the Joker and the Penguin. Now, sing along with me. Fall asleep, my darling. Fall asleep, my dear. 
Close your eyes and you will drift so far away from here. I was up all night, closing my eyes for a moment can't hurt. All asleep is the heat, all my heat I missed. But be sure to wake up all the audition you will miss. Uh. <gasps> I'm going to miss the auditions. Also, Mr. Miss doesn't really rhyme. <gasps> Nearly noon! I have one minute to get to the gym for auditions. What are you talking about? It's only pizza o'clock and the auditions aren't until hamburger. Let's hang out until pie 30. What's going on here? What are you talking about, sucker? Like, it's just another normal day at Strange Hill. OMG. Ah, I've got to get out of here. I've got to get to the auditions. This has to be a dream. A crazy dream! Actually, all dreams are illogical. Templeton, you're making sense. This must be a dream, but how do I know for sure? Hmm. Break into song? Hit it! How do you know if you're stuck in a dream? Is Stephanie Bethany suddenly gangstery? A bully's not quite what they seem. Can you tell if you're stuck in a dream? If you pull out your eyes, are they replaced by two pies? Is your headmaster made of ice cream? Hmm, I believe I'm pistachio. I'll tell you how to tell if you're stuck in a dream. Come to the lab and I'll continue to blab as we solve it with science and schemes. See, if this is a dream, then none of it's real. And this atomic explosion, none of us will feel. If you're going to prove it, I'd like you to move it or I'll miss my audition. So get on with that vision. So if this is real, we'll die? Yes, exactly. Why? So wait. Too late. So this is just a dream. So it would seem. <laughs> Do you mind if I scream? <laughs> if this is my dream, why are you guys here? Good point. I should just be able to step through the store and be out of here. Oh, stupid dream logic. Which way do we go? I know. Melodioso. <gasps> I've come for you, Becky Butters. You? What, what do you want? You, Becky Butters. I thought I made that clear. Conductor's buttons? Nice. My compliments to your subconscious. They call me the grackle for my scary cackle. Don't give me no flackle. I dress all in blackle. I'll put you in. Shackles and eat you for snackers And then I won't floss Cause I love dental plucker You think you get away But guess what No way You won't I'm too smart For you So boo-hoo Yes I'm the grackle I dress all in black I'll just try to fight back And I'm back out, back out, out. Shouldn't we have run while she was singing Probably How about now Probably. Nice knowing you. There's no use running. Guys, I'm so sorry I got you into this. Look, 
All she wants is me, so go. Just go. Save it for the stage, sister. We're not abandoning you. But she just said, Look, Bex, if this is your dream, then everything in it is just in your head, right? Yeah. So that monster out there, that's just in your head, right? Lucky head. Only thing in my head is what socks I'm going to wear tomorrow. Stripes. So the grackle is really just a combination of all my fears and stuff put together. Maybe combined with whatever you ate for breakfast. So if I can stop worrying, maybe it will go away. Brilliant! Mm. But is this you, Mitchell, telling me this stuff, or is it just my version of you telling me what I already figured out but through you, you, to me? Something you ate for breakfast? I'm going to go with me, because that makes me smart and brave, which are two things I've always dreamt of, along with being the best singer in the world, so... I'd be happy with smart and brave. And why are my friends in my dream? Because friends make me happy, and friends help calm me down. So figments or friends, go! <laughs> you call? <gasps> Sup, my excellent friends. Safety Toad! I invented him years ago to keep monsters away at bedtime, along with Happy Bear. Uh... Happy Bear sort of freaked out and ran off, but I'm here, and I'll get you to safety. Let me in. I need to destroy Becky. Also, I'm getting tired of Mitchell. Hey! Now the key is to stay mellow. Don't show your fears or anxieties. I'm gonna open the door on free, dig? You expect us to follow some mellow trick toad? Yeah. Follow the Mellow Trick Toad. Yes, it's my dream, and we're going to follow the Mellow Trick Toad. Your dream, you can follow Optimus Prime, but my dream, Toad. Okay, dudes. One, two... Just follow the Mellow Trick Toad. Everyone mellow. And three. She's frozen! Follow the Mellow Trick Toad. Follow the Mellow Trick Toad. Yeah. Like, follow the Mellow Trick Toad, okay? Follow, 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 follow the Mellow Trick Toad. We're off to flee the grackle. The grackle in my head. If you can chill, then you can kill the freaky deaky fears that make you feel real ill. If you can flee the grackle. The grackle in my head. Awesome. I think she's like totally got it. <laughs> oh, you led us right to her. What kind of safety toad are you? Hey, life's crazy, man. Sometimes you get the grackle. Sometimes the grackle gets you. Point is, it's not good to trust a vice just because it's being sung. Shut up! Catch y'all on the flip side! Well, you wanted to audition. I'm waiting. <clears throat> just as I thought. You can't sing to save your life. Ah! Becky! Bex! Becky, remember what the toad said. But the toad fled. It's all in your head. The grackle's nothing but a figment of your imagination. You're right. Stop helping her. And now, to dispense with you once and for all. You don't scare me. You're just my anxieties and fears rolled into one ugly monster. Take that back. And if I ignore you, you'll go away. Look. Me. No, I'm ignoring you. La 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 la. No, la, la, not la, the ignoring la, 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 and la, 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 the horrible la, la. singing. No. Ha! It worked. The Greco was nothing but a representation of my fears, and I conquered them. I conquered the Greco. Can a representation do this? Oh. <laughs> ah. Ah. Becky! Becky. Bex. Hey. Here, this works with my dog. Wake up, dog! No, no, get away. She's trying to tell us something. What is it, girl? Is it a fire at the old mill? Temp, she's not a dog. You're going to feel pretty bad if the old mill burns down. That gives me an idea. 
What a terrible dream! Ah, <sighs> Beezers. It was just a dream. Whew, a nightmare. Miss Crackle was this hideous monster. Well, she is a hideous monster, but only metaphorically. And in my dreams, she really was just a representation of all my fears and anxieties. But I faced her down, and you were there, and you were there, and... Oh. Hello, friends. You weren't there. I'm stuck to my seat with gum. Oh, no. It's nearly hamburger o'clock. Um, I mean noon. I only have two minutes to get to the audition. Bye. See you tomorrow. I can do this. I just need to swallow my fears and I can do it. You could always try out for a lesser role. Well, I thought you said she was an awful... Hey! Oh. You guys don't think I can sing? No, it's not that. It's just that, you know, that. <laughs> What's that? Funny thing about fears. The more you swallow them down, the more you ignore them, repress them, the bigger they become. It's the Grackles. She followed me out of my dream. Man, why couldn't that have happened when I dreamt about those sausages? She isn't real. Oh, I'm real, all right. Very real. And now, Becky Butters, I'm going to finish you off for real. Uh, what do I do? Repressing my fears just made them worse. Mitchell, Templeton, help! I need mean, Mitchell, help! What did I do in your dream? You told me to run. That seems good. Run! <laughs> you can run from your fears, but you can't hide. <laughs> no running! <laughs> no evil tackling! So Miss Grackle isn't really a hideous monster. Excuse me. Nothing. <laughs> I say, you look familiar. Ah! Becky Butters! You can't escape me, Becky Butters. you can defeat this is to get up on that stage and sing. What? But you think I can't sing. Listen, sometimes the only way to get over something is to do the one thing that scares you the most. Wait, are you the real Mitchell telling me this or just the me Mitchell from my dream? What? I'm me, Mitchell. Me, Mitchell? No, you're Becky. Oh, come on. Bex, I don't know what you're talking about. Just listen to what's inside you. I can do this. I'll make you a deal. You told me I couldn't sing to save my life. Well, I happen to think I can sing to save everyone's life. Let me sing. If I'm good, you leave us alone forever. And if I'm no good, well, do with us what you want. We are toast. Mm, game over. Why not? This should be fun. Well, Becky Butters, I'm all ears. Could you play this, please? No. Why not? Because it's the owner's manual for an electric tin opener. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, no. Wait, let, let me start again. And she said she sang fine in the shower. Too bad they're not having the auditions there. Showers! That's it! No. We can't go to the showers. I'll have to take my shirt off. No! Water! No. She sang well in the shower, and when I threw water on her, no. she didn't sound half bad. No. No. Becky, you can do it. I've just got...
got to hit one of those fire sprinklers. Yes. Once I was so scared of everything I feared. Yes. There's something new I've heard. Scared, feared, heard. They don't exactly rhyme. Eh, she's on a roll. It's the voice inside me. You can hide me because inside me I am beautiful. No, you're not supposed to have a nice voice. Hey, what are you doing? My talent. Source of all my power. She's the star of the show. So let us introduce to you the incomparable, unstoppable, totally tip top of all. She's the key part. Our heart flutters. You're all nutters. But you have. Maybe musicals aren't so bad after all. What am I doing here? This better be a dream. Ooh, don't worry, Mitchell. See you. Get what this will be. It'll be a great musical. I'm like boring. Snoozical. <laughs>